back to look closer. Let's hop straight into when to find peacock spiders. Peacock spiders are what's called an annual species. They only really live, for the most part, about one year. So they all hatch out at the same time, they grow up together, they all mate at the same time, and then they all die off for the year until next year when the babies hatch again and they all start again. So if you're looking for peacock spiders at the wrong time, you're probably gonna be out of luck. So the normal peacock spider cycle throughout the year starts with the babies hatching in around about late summer, early autumn, which is now. So all we're gonna find at the moment where we are is small peacock spiders, babies, the first ones of the year. They all grow up together throughout the year, throughout the winter, and then in spring, they all put on their final colours. They do their final molt, the boys put on their colours and they dance with the females, then they mate in the late spring, and then the females go to ground with their eggs and the males all die off. So your window for finding peacock spiders in colour is gonna be spring, which is convenient in Western Australia because that's the same time as the orchids come out. So if you're finding orchids, you'll also be able to find peacock spiders. Right now, we're in mid-autumn which means the babies have just hatched and they're really hard to find. <laughs> so this is a terrible time to find peacock spiders in colour, but what it is, is a great time to hone your skills to be able to find peacock spiders when the time comes. So what we're looking for right now is a baby. And the babies are around about two millimetres long. They're very small. And if you can find these guys, you'll easily find adults. Now, just like the orchids, these guys don't all come out in colour at the same time. You'll find there's some early species and you'll find there's some late species, and that's the same across the country. The early ones tend to start colouring up in late autumn. That's Chrysomelis, with the next lot starting in the middle of winter, so July. You may have heard recently one called the Starry Night Peacock. That comes out in July, so that's a really early one. These guys, where we are now, the speculifers, the black mirror peacocks, they tend to come out quite early too, and you'll find them from winter. You'll find them in colour from late winter. But the other ones, the blue ones, the coastal peacock spiders, you'll find them in full colour in spring. And as you move south throughout Western Australia, the far southern coastal species are uh, really late. So you'll find colour on those ones all the way through until December, so midsummer again. It's important to know what you're looking for at different times of the year. If you're looking in autumn, like I am now, you'll be looking for babies. If you're looking in winter, you'll be looking for brown ones. They haven't coloured up yet, so they're a bit bigger, maybe three or four, maybe five millimetres long. They'll be brown, they'll be really hard to find because they're camouflaged. They're not trying to find females yet, they're not trying to find a mate yet, and all they're trying to do is get big, stay hidden, not be eaten by something bigger than them. If you wait until spring, that's when the show starts. So you'll find males in full colour, you'll find females that are big and fat and gravid with eggs, and that's when you're gonna find the dancers as well. This is the time when the peacock spiders really shine, when they really put on their colours and really put on their dancers. <laughs> 